the Las Vegas Convention Center is entering a new era when it comes to health and technology. It will be the first convention center in the world to offer on med. It's a high tech virtual healthcare station. Hector Mejia live from the convention center with a look at that. Hey Hector, this sounds really cool. Hey there, we're inside the booth. It, uh, it looks like a booth. It's really high tech and really futuristic. It basically connects convention goers and employees virtually with a healthcare provider. Joining us this afternoon to talk about the high tech features in here, we have Austin White, CEO of OnMed. Good afternoon to you, sir. Thank you, Hector. Good afternoon. So what makes this so high tech? Well, this ties in telemedicine with virtual calls with a uh, telehealth provider and the ability to dispense medications at point of access. What are we looking looking at right now coming down from the ceiling. This would be a high definition handheld autofocus camera that looks into your eyes, ears, nose, throat and skin with a 4K uh, technology in high def. What does this allow uh, a person walking inside do when they interact with a medical professional? It takes telehealth to the next level in diagnostic capability. The uh, opportunities for a stethoscope to be uh, listening to your ears, I mean to your heart and lung sounds, along with a uh, high definition thermography camera to detect your temperature, your height, weight, your blood pressure, your pulse, your pulse oximetry, uh, gives the uh, clinician significant amount of diagnostic capability in order to give you a proper diagnosis and prescribe the proper medication. So as I'm trying to uh, get a close-up view of my hand here, um, trying to uh, use this here on my hand. Just, just put it right on your skin. So we are talking also with a medical pro provider right in front of us on this screen. And uh, what is this used for to, let's say, maybe look inside your ear or look at the back of someone's throat? The back of your throat, the eye, uh, certainly the skin for a dermatological appointment. Uh, there's, you can put that right up to your eye. There you go. Wow, okay. All right, so, you know, I'm actually touching everything. How does this get sanitized? You know, we likely have people who are not feeling well walking inside. It's a great question. So what we do is we have ionized air that purifies the air consistently. And at the end of every visit, we leave all the diagnostic equipment hanging down and we uh, operate a UVC light fixture that kills C. diff in three minutes. So this will be the cleanest environment that any patient comes into next to a surgical OR. Wow, thank you so much for your time and also it'll be able to uh, dispense some medication as well down here after having that interaction with a medical provider. Uh, reporting from the Convention Center, Hector Mejia, back to you. Hector, we are all in the studio so amazed by this. This is so cool. So when will this be operational and where will these be located? Do we know? We do. Actually, very soon. It'll actually be uh, operational uh, by June 8th. That's when World of Concrete opens. So it'll be ready and open just in time for that large convention that's coming back to town. Wow, that'll be a oh, huge deal. It's also deal. located in the North Hall inside the convention center. Okay, yeah. so the North Hall. So it's not just that one next to you. There's going to be several. Is that right? Uh, just one, just one. Just one. But this one unit can see two patients at a time, and it's uh, located here inside the North Hall. We have our, we're taking a short walk here to show you uh, the other side of this, too, so you can see how high tech this is and all the moving parts that go along with this. Wow, that is so cool, Hector. What a game changer. Thank you so much. That'll be a big deal for World of Concrete. That'll be the first big event there in over a year. So thank you, Hector. Good work out there.